Now let me show you how to do dimensional math and conversions on your Construction Master Pro. And keep in mind, the keystrokes are exactly the same if you're using our trig model or our desktop models. Both give you fast, accurate solutions for all your dimensional math and conversion needs. Pretty much you put in dimensions the way you say them. You put in the number and then label it 12 feet, 7 inches, and any fractions down to 64 of an inch. Just the way you write it, 7 slash 8s. And I see there I've hit an extra 8. With this little backspace back arrow key, you can back digits out one at a time. So let's go back in and say 7 16 just for fun. Now you're not locked into the feet inch fraction format. You can mix formats together. For instance, plus 32.25 uh, inches, plus 36.2 uh, feet, minus 3 yards, uh, plus 2 meters, just to mix it up. Hit the equal key, it's going to come back in the format we started with, which is feet inch fractions. If you don't like that format, you can convert to feet, 49.0, back to feet inch fraction, inches and fractions, inches decimally, uh, yards, meters, you can even go to centimeters and millimeters over the 7 and 9 key here. But let me go back to feet inch fractions. Uh, so now you can add, subtract, multiply, or divide these. Let's say we want to divide that by 3 for equal spacing. Divide by 3 equals 16, 4 and a quarter. Or multiply. Say that's one side of a pad we want to pour uh, by 25 feet 7 inches. There's our square footage, square area. If we want to see that in yards for square yards of material, maybe flooring material, uh, you can see it in square meters, square feet, square inches, centimeters, and millimeters if you like. So there's our square footage. Now let's say we're going to pour that 4 inches deep by 4 inches equals 5.16 cubic yards. You make the same conversions there to cubic feet or cubic meters. Another way to work in uh, square footage and volume is to enter it directly. If you already know the number, you don't have to multiply it. Let's say 100 square feet. You would hit feet, feet. See, it now says square feet. Uh, you can now start calculating with that. Or if you press it one more time, it goes to cubic feet for cubic volume, and then you can convert that to yards or whatever else you want to do with that.